there's a tsunami and oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, we're under the water. Wait, where did the truck go? Okay, the truck is still here. How to do, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Stormworks today. Well, it's snowing. It is my favorite time of the year in Stormworks. It is a snowing like crazy, and unlike the past few years where I've had to add my own snow texture, they did it for us. It's beautiful. I absolutely love it, and they've done a great job. I haven't been in the desert yet, though, so I don't know if it's in the desert. Maybe one of you guys will let me know. But I have a little bit of a special video for you guys today. We're going to be testing a little creation I spent some time making. This is my mobile survival station. It used to be my zombie mobile survival station, but zombies weren't that much of a threat. Unless you didn't have a vehicle. Then, then it was very dangerous. But... This mobile survival station was initially made for zombie survival. Um, I, d I did spend a quite a bit of time designing, modeling it, and editing all the tire physics and whatnot to make it as best as it can be. But I've redesigned it now to be the ultimate weather survival station. So it is powered mainly by the truck here. The generators in the truck are charging the batteries in the mobile survival station as we speak. So let's go in and head inside here and let's go in and take a look. All the lights come on automatically because you need light all the time. So today, what we're going to be doing is testing this thing as much as we possibly can. Tornadoes, tsunamis, maybe even meteors and maximum weather settings. We're going to be seeing just how much this thing can survive. Uh, let's go in and power this thing on here. All right, there we go. And the first thing you're greeted with is a radar. This is scanning the area around us up to, uh, I believe it's like one kilometer or more. But this will tell us anything that's in our current area. And as right now, as, I'm, as I speak, I don't see anything. So we're all good there. If I press one, it goes over to a mobile camera. And I can zoom in and everything... So that way we can see our surroundings without having to go outside. What is always on, no matter the power of the mobile survival station, is this weather monitor right here. And this thing will tell us the true wind speed. And right now it's about 6 knots, not very fast, at a heading of 215 degrees. So, if I can find the workshop link for this, I will try to put it in the description of the video because this thing is absolutely amazing. It tells us how much rain, how much fog we got right now. And then we have the Magol displays. This tells us how much force our Magols are currently... Exp this tells us how much force our Magols are currently experiencing. And uh, when we get too close to the limit, which is about 200. If they get to 200, it's over, Chief. We're, we're done. We ain't going anywhere. And we have heaters because, well, it's a little cold outside right now. So I, I want to stay nice and cozy in here. We got tons of first aid kits, and we've got two flashlights if your batteries ever run out with welding torches as needed. So let's go ahead and go back outside here, and let's look at the lockdown system right here. This lockdown system consists of a ton of magals, and it, it's all deployed by pistons. So let's go ahead and deploy the system right now. Let's go ahead and alarm system radar lockdown. There we go. There it is, and look at that. They all go down all at once, and they should have a perfect connection as long as you're standing still. Now, they do have the chance to re-grab if and when you do get lifted off the ground. They can re-grab and try and hold down. I've had a few times where I was flipping in the air, and was able to re-catch the ground and stop myself from uh, inev inevitably flying into the tornado. So, here's the truck. You love it. You hate it. It is my favorite truck I've built, and I use it for pretty much everything. It's giant, the suspension on it. So let's go ahead and get in here. Um, yeah, when this thing is locked down, we're, we're, not, we're, we're not pulling it with the truck. It will just kill the truck. It, it is severely strong, and uh, yeah. All right, tsunami on the way. Oh, have mercy. We got a lot of time to wait, though, so... Um, uh, Oh my goodness, you alright? 
All right, let's go ahead and get in here. Let's door lock this thing. We need to be bunkered down, dude. The snow is hitting hard. Let's go ahead and look at our... Hey, 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 hey. Hey! Wait! No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Is that right on top of us? That might be right on top of us. The truck! The truck! The truck! Truck is moving. This is bad. This is really bad. It is really close. Okay. We are not experiencing too much force right now. Our force is, for right now, good. We got 4.2, 3... Wait, 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 wait. It's dropping. Is it getting... Hey! Okay, it's gonna do it's gonna go right by us, dude. It is going to go right by us. Oh, have mercy. What's the force? Nine. It's ten. Eleven. It's it's increasing exponentially. This is bad. It's really oh, oh, hey. Hey. It's a little close there. Okay, Magals are experiencing quite a bit of force right now. Hold on, brother. Hold on. It's still coming this way. It's still coming this way. It's right there. What's the force? What's the force? 60. We're holding on. It is on top of the hangar. Come on. What's the force? Okay. The force is okay. Magals to the right, of course, are not experiencing much, but the left is experiencing a ton right now. Okay. This is, this is getting a little, little crazy. Okay. I think, I think the threat has passed. It's gone the other direction. Where's it at? Okay, the heading is about 207 at 116. Wait, it's getting stronger. 120 knots. What's, wait, hey, where's it at? I can't see it. Hello? Is that it? I don't even see it. Where's it at? I think it's behind us. I think it's behind us. Oh, there's a tsunami! And oh! <laughs> ooh! 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Okay. We're under the water. Wait, where did the truck go? Okay, the truck is still here. We are completely underwater with the tornado right on top of us. Okay, the Magals are experiencing very low force. And we're out of the water. Full force. Oh! 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 No! 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 Okay, hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Reengage! 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 Oh no! This is bad! This is really bad! Uh oh, where are we? Where are we? Um, we're alive. We're alive so far. I can't tell where we're at. Let's try and fix some things here. Okay, the monitor. Everything is offline. Oh, we're definitely getting sent right now. Where are we? Oh, look at the damage. Oh, my goodness. The truck lifted up and we could not hold ourselves. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> we just got launched. Brace for impact. Wait, where are we? Where are we? Where's the ground? Brace for impact. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my goodness. Did we land? We landed. Oh my goodness. I don't think this is this is like irreparable damage. The amount of damage we've just taken. It almost it almost survived the tornado. Okay. So for next time, I'm gonna make a few more renditions of this thing. <laughs> this thing is like bad, dude. Okay, okay, I'm repairing it. The lights are coming back online. But I have a feeling I just need to get out of here. Okay. How far did we get launched? Oh, yeah, it's bad. It's really bad. Yeah, I don't think there's much getting this fixed. Oh, there we go. It's coming back online, but it's still flipped, and there's nothing I can do about that. Have mercy. That was insane. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see how far we got sent. Where even are we, dude? Oh my goodness, look how far this is. We almost got sent a kilometer away by that meteor strike. 
That was awesome. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I've got something a little bit special planned for Christmas. It's a story type video. I'm going to see if I can get it out then. Where am I get in the way? But it's a, it's a little bit of a revisit to one of our previous video I've, I've made. And it's been a long time since I've made it. But we're going to see what I can do. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It was a lot of fun. I did have to re-record it again because the first time uh, I tried to record it in 120 FPS and it did, didn't work at all. So uh, lesson learned there. Um, but this video was absolutely amazing to make. I am going to make some renditions to the trailer uh, to make it a little bit stronger and to actually have a truck release button because what I realized is that the main weakness of that trailer is when the tornado gets right on us. The trailer might be able to su survive the forces, but the forces of the truck ripping the trailer up is enough to just completely destroy it. So, I want to have a truck release button. That way I can say bye-bye to the truck and stay safe in my little trailer as long as the tornado is around. That is the plan for V2 of the Mobile Survival Station. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode. I will see you guys in the next one. God bless you.